Hey everybody, it's Dr. Nicole Friels again. Welcome back to my closet. Um, since we are all staying home, uh, trying to be safe, I thought it'd be a good idea to do a video on proper house shoes because um, there's lots of options and the way I always look at it, it kind of just depends on what activity you're doing in the house. So if you're lounging around something that's a little more lightweight, a little more cushy um, is going to be just fine. But if you are, you know, doing your chores or getting organized, spring cleaning, then I definitely would recommend a different type of shoe. So let's start with being the most active to the least active. And I'll take you through my closet and my shoes and also my husband's so you can kind of see from both ends for men and women. So first things first, activity shoe. Go to your tennis shoe. Any of your tennis shoes, just make sure, do my uh, twist test, twist it, bend it. If it's soft and flexible, this is not something you will need to, you wanna be doing when you're taking the clothes up and down the stairs or you know in the kitchen, especially if you have hardwood, hardwood floors. Um, or linoleum or something like that, you're going to tear up your feet. Even though if you're not at work standing, it's going to be hard on your feet in the long run. Number two, let's step it down. What if you're, you know, going to be not pounding the whole day, but you're going to be doing some light activity. So that still, I would go for, you know, a tennis shoe, but I would go for one of my, you know, lighter weight, more flexible tennis shoes, such as the uh, Brooks Launch. So this was a Levitate. This is a launch, I'm gonna show you why. Twisting, see it's a little more bendy. Um, now, what if you're just like, you know, watching Netflix and just relaxing? Well, two things. One, if you're really just gonna be sitting, then don't wear anything, you can go barefoot, it doesn't matter. But if you're gonna maybe getting up in the kitchen and cooking lunch for 30 to 45 minutes, then I would at least throw on a decent house slipper. So, a couple options for you. Um, I will grab my faves. So, first thing, this is an Olakai. It actually looks like a shoe. Now, a lot of people wear these out and about. Not a big fan of that. I mean, if you're on, you know, vacation, that's fine. But this is, I call, you know, my, my house shoe. I wear this, again, minimal activity. Um, this, you can't even read the label because it's worn off. So I guess I needed to order a new pair. This is my Toms. Now you can see there's not a lot to it, but I do like the sole of it, how it's cushy. So it's got some rubber and not all Toms are built the same and you know the bobs and things like that some look at the sole of it you'll notice how the th cheaper the thinner it gets and then you can kind of roll it up like a sock so this still has a decent um you know sole to it uh for these i'd recommend every six months here's my kush kush one this is acorn you know i love this brand this is really kind of whenever you're getting cold <laughs> because it's fleece lined but look here it bends a lot so this is a shoe i'm wearing when I'm sitting and just kind of kicking around. So those are my favorite three. So anyway, um, these are the tips you, you know, you need to pay attention to when you're at home. So you're not doing damage to your feet. Uh, don't forget we are at the office. Uh, Dr. Amy Barco is taking telemedicine appointments. Um, so if you have any issues, you're starting to have some pain, even some mild pain, give us a call. Cause you know, maybe you just need a, just a couple tips of ice and rest and call you in an anti-inflammatory anything like that we are still here so please give us a call um, otherwise drop a comment below what do you guys want to hear about what do you want to what do you want to know i'm just kind of hanging out in my house organizing so please um make sure you kind of get back with me and, and let me know what you want to hear um, otherwise i will see you next time thanks again for watching all right take care and stay safe